Hello everybody, uh, today I'm going to be talking to you about um, showering with dreadlocks when you don't want to get them wet because um, I'm not going to name any names but I've seen a couple of videos, maybe two or three videos of people talking about how they shower um, with dreads and don't want to get their dreads wet and actually it kind of made me laugh, it's it's kind of funny You, I've seen these people, I don't know if you do it as well, maybe you do and I'm just going to try and give you a much easier, simpler way more, more logical way, it's just a bit stupid the way you were doing it or well, not you personally, but you know, people were doing it. Because I've had my dreads now for four years and a whole month, and I have never once used this um, technique of keeping them dry, because if you ask me, when they're short, it doesn't really matter if they get too wet. Like, I'm talking short, short, like, you know, up here somewhere short, because they're going to dry quickly. They're, they're not going to be mature. They're not going to hold a lot of moisture in them. You'll be able to wring them out and, and towel dry them pretty quickly. <clears throat> and as they grow down, and they're long enough to tie up, then that's when my technique comes into play because you guys seem to wear a bag on your head. Yeah, a bit like a shower cap, but it's like, you know, one of those sports drawstring bags, like plastic ones with the drawstring at the top, so you put your hair in it and you fucking drawstring it up. What the fuck's that, seriously? Um, yeah, just tie your hair up. That's all I do, literally. You get your hair into a ponytail like this. Okay, you have a band on your wrist, which I have mine over here. So I'm using an elastic band at the moment, but I would usually have like a, a regular kind of long hair band, one you can sort of double over, but the, this works fine, Pla elastic bands are fine. Then you just put your hair into a bun, okay, not a ponytail, because a ponytail hangs down. Put it into a bun, so you hold it in the middle, pull it over, and you fold the hair back like this. Pick up any stragglers, push them in. This one here, you tuck them in. Okay, look. Now, there's no hair on my neck. All of my hair is right up here. Okay? Apart from that little one there, tuck him back in. You will have the odd hair, that, the odd dread that hangs down. But that's nothing to worry about, really. Like, you, what, are you really going to worry about having one wet dread? I'm not bothered. Uh, I've just washed. I've literally just had a shower and done this and didn't wash my hair, and my hair is bone dry. I haven't. There's no moisture in it at all. Maybe just here where I've been like washing it up. Other than that, it's, that's not even wet though. You can't even say it's wet. So yeah, basically, this is a much much simpler way. It's gonna save you going to a fucking sports shop to buy one of those stupid bags, or buying something that comes in a bag like that. Um, yeah, just it's just much more simple. Um, so yeah, guys, hope this helped. Um, <clears throat> one thing I will say is that when you're washing the back of your neck and stuff, if you want to get the water right to the top, literally just hold the bun up and then le lean under your shower to get all this bit here. It's not it's not rocket science, man. I mean, I've been doing this for four and a half, well, four years and a month, so, and I've never had a problem. My hair doesn't get wet when I do this, so yeah. Cheers, guys. Hope this helped. See ya.